something. little nudge. You nudge. know, I, I, I was just a part of a, an awesome team. So, uh, what what are the plans for the future? What's what's next in uh, in Jace Hall's world? Um, certainly, uh, the Jace Hall show keeps me involved with sort of the top people in gaming. We go and meet them and check out stuff. Um, so I plan to continue to you know keep those relationships yeah. and, and, and that stuff. Um, aside from that, which which sort of leads me into, I really like the idea of using the internet for uh, telling stories and not being confined to the restrictions of television or the barriers of people who decide that content you know people shouldn't want to shouldn't see. So you know much like uh, this network. You guys are building stuff, making it, covering a very important topic. Um, I totally support what you guys are doing. That This is the future. And I want to be heavily involved with that. So my uh, company, HD Films, yes, it produces television, but that is sort of a secondary objective for traditional TV. It's really focused on developing stuff for online, um, telling stories, building communities, and, and um, letting people who who are looking for certain kinds of content finally get at it, finally someone making something. Yeah. A, a good example of this is on TV, they don't do anthology programming anymore. Um, you know, self-contained stories, everything is totally serialized. Mm. And I want to see anthology, like The Twilight Zone, which yeah. it's, right, but they don't make them anymore. So the web is a, a very good place to bring anthology back and, and show that, um, you know, there's interest in it. Yeah, now you actually came out with a quite a a hit sensation with I play WoW. Uh, your uh, I guess your music foray into the uh, into the internet world. Uh, any plans to do more with that? Um, yes, actually. So, for the audience, the Jace Hall show started to spit, spin off music videos. It actually occurred to me there's 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 a whole hip hop community that does this uh, category called nerdcore, and if you were to look at hip hop today, it's actually gotten very very uh, repetitive. You're either party, 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 or you know, I love you and I or I hate you. But that's it. There's nothing in between. And it yeah. really surprised me that no one was talking about, you know, why didn't you add me a fr as a friend on Facebook? So those sorts of things. So there is a community called Nerdcore. And so I thought, wow, the Jay's Hall show is talking to you know 10 million people. Why don't we start doing music videos? And I have a music background, so I wind up uh, writing these songs and creating these songs. And one of them was a song about being a World of Warcraft player. Anybody who's played World of Warcraft for any extended period of time has heard, why don't you go outside, you're lazy, you're wasting <laughs> your time. And so it builds up this frustration and anger, which is basically, kiss my ass. So I wanted to make a song that really spoke to that frustration of not only a World of Warcraft player, but also anybody who plays a massively multiplayer online game. They always hear this stuff. So we make this music video, put it out, four million people watch it. So next thing I know, um, I'm talking to Capcom, who does Street Fighter, and they're like, it'd be great if you could um, do a Street Fighter music video. So we recently shot and uh, created a, a Street Fighter music video. It's not out yet, but it'll be released soon. It'll be out soon? Yes, it, it'll be out soon. When and can we expect it? <sighs> October 1st. October 1st, somewhere around, right around there is when you should start to see it. OK, fantastic. Um, so you'll probably see more uh, music videos come out of us uh, like that. Is that the direction you're heading in? Are you trying I, it's to just, more it's fun. I think it's a way of of sort of bringing these cultures together because if you do music that's commercial enough, that's, that's pleasant enough to anybody, whether they game or not, it, it really shows you know different aspect to the community and, and yeah. just a whole online thing. So you know, I'm, I'm I've been eyeing uh, Mortal Kombat. I've been eyeing some of these other big games to maybe do um, a music video for them and. As long as people watch them, we'll keep on making them. Fantastic. I think we're all looking forward to it. Now, word is that there is a, a developing beef between you and Felicia Day. Are the rumors true? You know, rumors are rumors, you know? They, you, you, are they true or are they not? The point is, is when she came on my show, she had the audacity to uh, tell me that more people watch The Guild than, my, than my show. Statistically, though, that and, and, and I, you know, I didn't... Statistically, though. Well, I, you know, it depends on how you count the beans, really. But she didn't need to clown me on my own show. And so uh, it was after that point, things were not 
things were not as the same. Uh, well i mean you know it, she's it, oh she gets 20 million people watching her show okay that's fine and what 11 million people watch her music video <laughs> But I'm not really watching. I'm not keeping track of this stuff. Well, we, I mean, you weren't one of them, so well, no, that's, that's so it's important. No, people have told had told me about it, and and she actually, we came into our office. She had actually trashed my office, and I have this uh, doll, which I thought was is kind of human. Before before you go into it, I have a sneaking suspicion we may actually have a snippet of footage from that exact event. Let me take a look. Jace Hall used to have a baby Jesus doll. Do you know who has it now? Felicia Day, because she came and stole my baby Jesus doll. Oh, oh no, she didn't. Oh, Felicia Day, she bitches! She has the baby Jesus doll. She stole my baby Jesus doll. What are you doing here? I'm doing an interview with Michael Scott. We're shooting our show. The wait, little... wait, wait, wait. Michael Scott, Dor Dorkman? Yeah. I love that video. I love. I even sent you an email one time. I was like, yeah, let's yeah. work together. No, we, no. we have to. I mean, there's no, have there's to no this. work. No, we okay, should... whoa. I love the guild. Thank you. Watchtheguild.com. Watchtheguild.com. No, we're not doing that. All I want is my baby Jesus doll back. You're never getting your baby Jesus unless you apologize. You took my World of Warcraft character and killed him over and over and then posted it on the internet. You found her? Yeah, I've got you her target. Her. Kill her fast and bad. I think I'm going to drop her from the sky. Oh, oh man. Oh. Pow. Uh oh, I think you've been discovered. Did you see? Did you see? She, she taunted. She, she, she taunted, ran, the, the office was trashed. Called us bitches. The battleground is not entirely bloody on her side. Apparently you... Well, I thought that, you know, now this is the difference. You know, I sort of, I, I'm a true original gamer. That means my mob runs deep. I can make phone calls. I can get things to happen. And you know, she plays World of Warcraft. So I had the guys and gals down at Blizzard go into God mode and find her in the game and just kill her over and over and over and over and over. <laughs> And uh, at some point she figured out it was me. But at that point I didn't care, I was so totally satisfied. What, and they picked her up into the sky and dropped her like a thousand, <laughs> then you watch her little avatar bounce, it was funny. But yeah, I mean, it, it's on, it's kind so of. So where to from, from here with Felicia Day? Obviously it's, I think the, the ball is in your court. Well, you know, we, I, I, I ran into her at an internet cafe and we sort of duked it out there with lightsabers. Let's take a look. Oh wait, look what I found. Well, it's funny you should bring that because I have this with me. Do we have a problem? I don't know. Do we have a problem? Do we? Do we have a problem? Oh, we do. I want my baby Jesus doll back. You owe me an apology. Okay, so Felicia and you are at a point in time. Where to from here? It's, well, we're gonna, I think we'll remain mortal enemies. Mm. And um, I won't stop until I have twice the amount of viewers as she does ever on anything. Bottom line. That's fair enough. That's, and, uh, that's fine. You know, she, uh, you know, she's a tough one. She's not, she's not gonna go down easily. But, you know, I'm ready. I'm ready. And I think you'll probably see in season four some more confrontation. We can't wait. Jace, thank you so much for coming to join us. Thanks for having me here. Can't wait to see what you've got lined up in the future. I'm going to try my best. Guys, don't forget to check us out on the next episode of In Gaming Tonight when hopefully we'll have some real celebrities hey. and we'll have a great show ahead of us. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs>